Welcome to Ethical Hacking for Beginners, Aircrack NG. In this video, we're going to take a look at what is Aircrack NG and using Aircrack NG to crack web encrypted Wi Fi. So, what is Aircrack NG? Aircrack NG is a command line tool that is used to inject or collect wireless packets. Now, an important note here is that we need real tech drivers in order for this to work to inject wireless packets. So we need an Alpha Wi-Fi card. Now since this is for beginners, we do have a simplified GUI to make things a little easier called Fern Wi-Fi Cracker. So let's go ahead and fire up our Kali Linux. And I have a demo router set up that's running web that we can try to crack. So we're going to go to wireless attacks here in applications. 8211 wireless tools and right here to fern Wi-Fi cracker okay we get a little pop-up a professional version is available I don't want to visit the website and there is no new update available and you can see here it is using aircrack ng in the background so we're gonna go ahead and select our WLAN 0 interface which is my alpha card what this is doing right now is it's setting up a monitor mode interface. An interface, there you go, named WLAN0MON in order to inject packets. Next we're going to hit scan for access points. And you'll notice now that we have one network that's WEP protected, detected, and one that's WPA detected. For this demo, we're not going to be cracking WPA, but it's important to know that to, in order to crack WPA, you need to capture the handshake for one, and number two, in your password list, you need to already have the password for that network in your list. So let's go ahead and, and select our web, and here you'll see ethical hacking demo. This is my access point. I'm going to click automate here. And you'll see down here it lists the details, the, the BSSID, which is the MAC address of the access point, what channel it's on. It's using WEP. We're going to do a regular attack. And down here we're going to do an ARP request replay attack. Okay. Okay, so let's go ahead and hit this button up here, attack. So you'll see where thing, different things are lighting up here as it goes through different settings. We're associating with the access point. We've done that already. Now we're gathering packets. And now we're injecting ARP packets. And this number here is uh, injection vectors. Usually this number needs to get to 10,000 before we can crack WEP. So this is going to take a little while. In the interest of saving time, I'm going to pause the video. But let's take a look behind the scenes at what's happening. So behind the scenes, that first button that we pressed was probably using aircrack ng start wlan this sets up your monitor mode interface and probably in a separate process we use aerodump ng to start capturing packets for that specific access point and then when we inject packets we're using this command this airplay ng command actually it's this one down here with the uh, mac address of our uh, access point and a MAC address of a client that's connected to the access point. And then finally aircrack ng is the command that actually cracks the, the web or the PCAP file. So let's go back to our Kali Linux. You can see here we've, we've collected 700 packets. I'm going to open up a terminal here and try to speed things up perhaps. So using this command, airplay ng, and uh, 3 is the interval here, and we're going to use this access point MAC address. This H is the host or the, uh, the client that's connecting that we're going to spoof our request from and our interface, wlan0mon. So I go ahead and hit enter there. You'll see now we are, we are now injecting packets. And this number should be going a little faster now. Yes, it does appear to be going faster. But, so this is a, a waiting game here now. Could take, rather, anywhere between 5 to 10 minutes. Maybe longer, depending on the access point and your 
packets and how complex your web encryption is that you're trying to break. So I'm going to go ahead and pause. All right, so this took a little bit of time, but as you can see here, Fern Wi-Fi Cracker finally cracked it, the encryption, the web key. This is in fact my web key for the ethical hacking demo access point. So there you go. And now we have this key database. So in this database, we have our access point encryption web, and here's the key that has been saved. All right, so in our next video, we're going to be looking at the man in the middle attack.